All right, how's it going everyone? Today we have a really, really interesting theory coming from one of the TV spots for The Last Jedi, which involves Poe Dameron going one-on-one -on -one with the First Order. So in about the middle of the TV spot, we see Poe Dameron in a special X-Wing with BB-8 fly down alone in front of a Dreadnought class First Order Star Destroyer, which if you haven't seen before, these things are massive, and we've only seen it in concept art, but I have a feeling we're gonna be seeing a lot of these within The Last Jedi. And here's the whole clip right now. Happy beats here, buddy. Come on. So good to have you back. BB-8, punch it! Now, if we go to the very beginning of the scene, we can see that there is no one else in sight, and it looks like he's alone. He closes his S-foils, and then prepares the launch really fast into the Dreadnought, but for what reason? So as we all know, Poe Dameron is now considered the best pilot in the galaxy, so he could be on a one-man mission to take down this Dreadnought, or to divert its attention from an impending attack from the Resistance, we have no idea. Plus, you have to assume that if the Resistance were to send anyone on a one-man mission, it would be Poe with BB-8. Also, let's go ahead and talk about Poe's awesome turbo-boosted X-Wing. Uh, is he going to be the only ship that has a turbo-boost in the back, or are other Resistance fighters going to have it? I'd love to see the Millennium Falcon have it. That'd be so awesome, just having that thing zipping away. And plus, that means it could probably make the Kessel Run probably in like 8 seconds instead of 12. <laughs> Yeah, go ahead and let me know what you think in the comments below. Is Poe on a one-man mission or is he not? This just looks so strange that one lone X-Wing would be charging towards a Dreadnought like that. For what reason? Uh, go ahead and let me know and I will see you in the next one. Stay on the high ground.